So when I was researching building Hillary Clinton, I went to Amazon.com. I literally bought every book ever written on the Clintons. So when I say these things about these politicians, I'm not just, you know, pulling it out of my ass. I back it up. How many books about the Clintons do you think you have? I might have uh, 200, 300 books on the Clintons. You've read all of them? I, I read and I skim probably all of them, absolutely. I do my research. It's amazing that many books about the Clintons have been written. And a lot of the really uh, obscure ones is where you learn the most. So this is uh, your version of the Clinton Library? Yeah, Clinton has a library, L-I-E, library. <laughs> And, and Rick Perry reminds me a lot of Bill Clinton. What other kind of materials and documents do you have stored away? Yeah, come on over here. I'll show you my JFK collection. Here's my uh, library on the JFK assassination, uh, also known as the 1963 coup d'etat. Uh, in my opinion, uh, Lyndon, Lyndon Johnson and his Texas oil men used their CIA military connections uh, to murder John Kennedy for many reasons, uh, both uh, personal and political. And so this is an uh, eight foot tall bookcase, four feet wide, with some of the best JFK books out there. And you've been through most of these? Yeah, I can't read them all, but you, know, you read the, here, I'll, I'll give you a book to read right here. Here's one of the best books to read on the JFK assassination. It just came out recently. It's LBJ, the mastermind of JFK's assassination. Um, I highly recommend it. It's cutting edge JFK research. That's another eight foot by four foot bookshelf with a lot of uh, political books and information. Got a lot of books on the bushes. Here's uh, Family of Secrets by Russ Baker, where he pretty much implies that George Herbert Walker Bush was involved in the JFK assassination which I think is very likely because Bush was high-ranking Texas CIA uh, in 1963 and he was supported by the exact same people that Lyndon Johnson were, uh, the Texas oil men, military contractors, CIA people. Why so interested in this kind of stuff? I'm a truth seeker and a truth teller, even if it's uh, the ugly truth. This book is called The Franklin Scandal. Um, Nick Bryan, who wrote this book, should get a Pulitzer Prize. He basically uh, nailed down the story of a 1980s pedophile ring that was uh, servicing the elite levels of the Republican Party in the 1980s. In fact, what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to give you that book right there. 